Hey everybody, Collecting Cardboard here with a new episode of uh, Topps Chrome 2020 Baseball Break. Uh, we have a hanger, we have a blaster, and we have a cello pack uh, that we're going to do. Um, I don't know if I have it as the uh, screenshot for the opening, but um, today I was fortunate enough to um, come across Chronicles basketball finally uh in my area here in new jersey it started trickling in on friday at certain uh walmarts uh some targets but uh the ones that i had visited didn't receive it yesterday monday um the 11th 10th or 11th was the first day um that our specific rep had even seen any so needless to say um i did get some today but that's not without stressing that it is an absolute zoo out there just to put it into perspective how crazy it is i'm in a you know one of the most densely populated states in the country in new jersey uh also one of the smallest but uh you know per capita one of the most densely populated and um needless to say there's a lot of walmarts and targets in in my general area uh the particular wall uh target that i was at today um uh at the beginning of this recent card craze actually i could say you know predated the uh craze we'll, we'll go back to like uh, late last year about this time last year maybe a little later right around september october of last year the particular uh target that i was at today there sometimes it would just be me sometimes it would be just one of my fellow collector buddies and at most i'd ever seen uh, was three or four guys up until um, COVID times. We'll we'll call it like maybe April, March, April. Then um, you know, on occasion you would see the the regular or usual four, and then another random guy or two there. So never, ever, ever any more than five or six. Well, two weeks ago um, during pack out day, uh, it was the as I say, the usual guys. It was myself, two of my fellow collectors that I have seen for the last year, and a guy we'd never seen before. So four total. Today, I got there at a decent time, around the time that he generally packs out, much to my shock and dismay. Well, not actually shock. I, I really tell you the truth. I'm not too shocked. There were 10 guys there already, and the rep had just gotten there. I said, and then talking... Um, one of the guys had heard through one of the other guys that one of the kids was there at 7.30 this morning. They're, like, queuing up. I mean, like, you know, without giving my age away, you know, when you used to have to queue up to get, you know, concert tickets, you know, at Ticketmaster and Ticketron. Holy cow. People are lining up before the store opens to get the cards. It's an absolute nut house out there, guys. So, you know, uh. God bless. Hopefully you guys can um, luck into some, but I'll tell you, if the competition is anything in your area like it is in mine, it is going to, you know, require a lot of bit of luck and quite a bit more uh, patience to get any uh, Chrome and uh, more so Chronicles basketball. But three minutes into the video, three and a half minutes, I did, um, like I said, manage to, to secure some Chronicles in a decent amount. Um... But we'll save that for another video. We're going to rip into these three uh, right here. The um, cello pack, the blaster, and the hanger box. Again, these are targets. So they are the three and three, not the three and five like the uh, Walmart ones. So we'll get right into this. Uh, I have two or three videos up already of the Topps Chrome. Um, and you can go ahead and check those out. And I don't want to spoil it, but... Uh, spoiler alert, spoiler alert, there wasn't any really big pull. So, um, actually, before I crack the first pack, as usual, thank you so much for checking out my video. Um, very humbled, very appreciative, and very thankful. Uh, if you haven't subscribed, please do so. You know the routine. YouTube.com slash C slash Collecting Cardboard. That's the channel. Uh, lots of good content. Uh, um, lots of, uh, prizes, giveaways, good stuff. PSA and BGS submission and reveals, and I have one coming this week too, a 10-card submission that I will be doing a blind reveal on, so please stay tuned for that. On to the break. Uh, Jan Mankata, Cattell Marte, um, the rookie pitcher, uh, Armenteros for, um, 
Houston, 85 throwback of Eloy. So, nothing big in that first um, inner pack of the cello. Moving on to pack number two. San Diaz. Uh, oh my god. Harold Ramirez. Pete Alonzo. And, oops, a dropped Sean Murphy. Hopefully not on the corner. No. Good. Sean Murphy, Refractor, Rookie Card. And the last pack of the cello pack. Come on, you know who we're looking for. The Lou Bobs and any big photo variations or short prints. LeMayhew. Another is San Diaz. Won't find two Lou Bobs in uh, two inner packs, right? Um, Aaron Savali. And another Eloy. Eloy Refractor. So two... Oh, no. That was, we had... What two or three white socks there in that in those packs? We got an Eloy Refractor, two Esons, um, Jan Moncada, and that's it. Yes, and, and another Eloy. So three Eloys in that those three packs. On to the bonus pink refractor pack. And I might have to actually bridge this video um, because this very well may cut out. I got to get more memory and new cards because, uh, quite frankly, all my cards are jammed up with other photos and videos that I haven't really backed up to the cloud or anything. So, all right. We got uh, Aaron Savale, Max Scherzer, and Zach Collins. All right. So, nothing big in the cello. Fine with that. Um, we will go on to the hanger. Um, Walmart hanger. Or excuse me, Target hanger. I keep saying, well, I keep talking Walmart. I got Walmart on the mind and when I'm talking about Target and Target on the mind when I'm talking about Walmart. So uh, five regular packs and then the, um, oh wow, see I haven't, I haven't gotten, I haven't gotten a hanger from uh, Target yet. Walmart has the gallery previews and these have uh, fire previews. So here's the gallery ones. This is from the Walmart. Um, I'll be giving some of these away also on the channel, so stay tuned. Uh, I don't know how I'm going to do it or what format I'm going to do it in, but uh, I'll be giving some of these away too. Um, I haven't opened any of these uh, fire uh, preview packs, so let's get, get that out of the way right away. So let's see um, what this is all about. Don't know anything about these, but we will find out. And that's not a bad start there. We got a Lou Bob right on top. Luis Robert, Luis Robert. Um... Rookie card. Alright. And then we got a Fernando Tatis, who's absolutely tearing the cover off the ball here. Uh, and then we have a Juan Soto, Bryce Harper, and a Big Poppy David Ortiz. Um, kind of sort of like Gallery, actually. Uh, cross between Gallery and then with, um, with Panini, you got like Diamond Kings. Very v bright and vibrant and colorful. So, not too bad. I think it's an entry-level product. Or middle of the road product, but uh, I, I dig it. I mean, for something to break, I'll, I'll be in on a couple boxes of this, but um, definitely loving that I hit a Lou Bob right on top, so that's a good start. All right, on to the first pack um, from this hanger, uh, Target Hanger Box ex exclusive uh, Scherzer, uh, Luzardo, Gio Urshela, and Aristides Aquino 85 throwback. Uh, to be honest with you, I'm really looking forward to tearing into that Chronicles, but I just wanted to at least get another video of the Topps Chrome up um, in the series. So, D. Gordon, uh, Brendan McKay, Clayton Kershaw, and a Willie Adames Refractor. Actually, one, talking to one of the guys who was at the Target today, um, actually yesterday at one of the stores in North Jersey, he hit a Zion uh, Auto out of one of the Chronicles hanger packs. So, huge, huge monster pull. Definitely a couple grand on that one. Um, so, congrats to him. Uh, his name is Joshua, if he happens to see this. Uh, Corey Kluber, Brandon Crawford, Trevor Story, um, Image uh, Reversal, or whatever they call that. And uh, Brock Burke, Trevor Story. Um, yeah, Trevor Story, uh, what do they call these? These aren't, um, just, I think they're called, uh, negative, or reverse negative or something like that, or negative image or something. I had to look it up, but they're actually pretty tough to pull. I think, um, 
I think they're like 1 in 36 packs or something like that. So, well, not tough, tough, but I mean, definitely, you know, they're not common. Uh, negatives, 1 in 87 packs, excuse me. So, you get 5 packs per box, so you do the math, you know, you're talking at least uh, about 15 packs, 14 packs to pull, or uh, hanger boxes, rather, to pull one of those. So, if my, my math might be a little bit off, but it's not easy. It's not easy. So, and it could be a lot worse uh, than Trevor's story. Um... Okay, next pack, we have a Jose Ur Urquide, Elvis Andrews, Lourdes Gurriel Jr., and Christian Yelich, who hopefully his bat starts coming around here soon, too. And last pack of the hanger box, we will have David Peralta hit a homer last night, I think, in Colorado. Big scoring game there. Um... Uh, Tommy Edmond, Hunter Dozier, and uh, Gene Segura, Refractor. So nothing really uh, huge so far. I mean, I, I would guess that the best card um, right now, uh, at least value-wise, would be the Trevor Story uh, negative. Um, this one, which for the time being, we'll put right there on that um, card stand. And um, I guess probably the Luis Robert uh, Fire Preview. Um, you know, probably not much, probably only a three to five dollar card, but, uh, you know, it's probably one of the better cards that I, I hit so far. Okay, and now, finally, we're on to the blaster box, uh, last, last, um, piece in this video. Let me grab the, uh, blade to cut this open. Okay. Here we go. Only partially open there. I already did. If anybody's interested in the no purchase necessary, uh, I did it for the hanger box. Or excuse me, I did it for the blaster box, not for the hangers. Woo! Technical difficulties. I just knocked the um, camera holder. Hold on one second. Bear with me. I think we're still live, so to speak. Yeah, we sure are, but we're a hot mess right now. I'm going to pause this. All right, and we're back after some technical difficulties there. Um, if you're uh, still here <laughs> with me, um, that's what happens when you have a poor man's setup, uh, studio setup, if you will. Uh, still trying to get this the kinks worked out here um, you know, on my setup. So um, if anybody's been with me for some time, you know that that's a work in progress. So, you know, if you're looking for a professional uh, production Certainly not going to find it on this channel, um, but um, it gets the job done. So we're on the uh, last uh, product of this particular break. It's the uh, blaster box, and um, let's see what we can do here. Alex Bregman, uh, Andrew Benintendi, Rowdy Roddy Talese, and uh, future stars Michael Chavez. This card looks weird. I guess it's just a lighting... Um, issue with the card because it's not a, a parallel or anything like that at least i don't think it is no it's not it's just it you know the camera doesn't do justice if you pull this rowdy tolis in in person you'll see what i mean compared to the other cards they're very bright and uh you know reflective refractive this is really really dull uh the rowdy tolis Tolez. okay enough time on that one Moving right along, pack two, Ozzy Albies, uh, Matthew Boyd, Alberto Mondesi, and a Jose Ramirez refractor. Come on, looking for a Luis Robert or some sh nice short print or super short print. Um, Jack Flaherty, Joey Abreu, that's the third or fourth uh, white sock that I already got. Uh, Swanson, and hey, it's not quite the Luis Robert we were looking for, but we'll take it. It's a Luis Robert 85 throwback. Um, he'll go right in front of the other Lou Bob card right there for the time being. And, um, yeah, so moving right along, we have three more packs plus the, uh, bonus, uh, sepia cards after this. Robbie Ray, Max Muncy, uh, Victor Reyes, Refractor of Chris Paddock. Okay, next pack. And I will be breaking the Chronicles uh, after this. I don't. I doubt I'm going to get it up today. Um, but you know, I want to 
slowly release these so I don't, you know, flood the channel, if you will, and I have content to add throughout the days. So Mike Trout, uh, Austin Meadows, Paul DeJong, and a Atomic of David Peralta. Okay, down to two packs plus the um, sepia bonus pack. Come on, where are you, Lou Bob? Uh, 